Many people believe that the alignment of the stars and planets at the time of our birth can influence our personalities, behaviors, and even our destiny. From the fiery Aries to the mysterious Pisces, each sign is associated with distinct traits. But can these traits also influence someone to become a serial killer? Astrology is just one of the many factors that shape a person, and it should never be used to stereotype or judge individuals. That being said, the fascination with the zodiac signs of infamous serial killers has led to some interesting discussions. So hold on tight, and let's go over the most infamous serial killers by their zodiac signs. The fire sign, Sagittarius, is ruled by Jupiter. Some serial killers under this sign include Ted Bundy, who kidnapped, raped, and murdered dozens of young women and girls during the 70s. After more than a decade of denials, he confessed to 30 murders committed in seven states between 1974 and 1978. Edmund Kemper Edmund Kemper, aka the co-ed killer, murdered 10 people from May 1972 to April 1973. His first victims was his own grandparents at the age of 15, and last victims being his mother and her friend. Gary Heidnick Gary Heidnick was a murderer and serial rapist who kidnapped, tortured, and raped six women, murdering two of them while holding them captive in a self-dug pit in his basement floor. The water sign Pisces are ruled by Neptune and Jupiter. Some serial killers under this sign include John Wayne Gacy, an American serial killer and sex offender who raped, tortured, and murdered at least 33 young men and boys. He became known as the Killer Clown due to his public performances as a clown prior to the discovery of his crimes. Richard Ramirez Richard Ramirez, dubbed the Night Stalker, was a sex offender whose crime spree took place in California from June 1984 until his capture in August 1985. Ramirez would often commit burglaries to support his drug addiction and murdered at least 13 people. Dennis Rader Dennis Rader, aka BTK, murdered at least 10 people in Kansas between 1974 and 1991. His victims were often bound, and he would keep trophies from his female victims, including underwear, licenses, and personal items. The air sign Gemini is ruled by Mercury. Some serial killers under this sign include Jeffrey Dahmer, also known as the Milwaukee Cannibal, who killed and dismembered 17 males between 1978 and 1991. Most of Dahmer's victims had been rendered unconscious prior to their murder, although some had died as a result of having acid or boiling water injected into their brain. Many of his later murders involved necrophilia, cannibalism, and the permanent preservation of body parts. David Berkowitz David Berkowitz, known as the Son of Sam, pled guilty to eight shootings that began in New York City on July 29, 1976. Using a 44 caliber Bulldog revolver, he killed six people and wounded seven others by July 1977, terrorizing New Yorkers. It was the biggest manhunt in the city's history, while leaving letters that mocked the police and promised further crimes. Kenneth Bianchi One half of the Hillside Stranglers, Kenneth Bianchi, committed at least 10 murders with his cousin in Los Angeles, and two more on his own in Washington. His preferred method of killing? Strangulation. The Earth sign Capricorn is ruled by Saturn. Some serial killers under this sign include Harold Shipman, aka Dr. Death, an English general practitioner. He is considered to be one of the most prolific serial killers in modern history, with an estimated 250 victims. On January 31st, year 2000, Harold was found guilty of murdering 15 patients under his care. Dean Coral. Dean Coral, aka the Candyman, was a sex offender who abducted, tortured, and murdered a minimum of 28 teenage boys and young men between 1970 and 1973 in Houston and Pasadena, Texas. He was aided by two teenage accomplices, one of which wound up shooting him to death. Israel Keys Israel Keys was a bank robber, burglar, arsonist, kidnapper, and sex offender. He murdered at least three people and committed dozens of felonies across the United States from July 2001 to his capture in February 2012. While awaiting trial, Keyes killed himself by slashing his wrists and hanging himself. The Earth sign Virgo is ruled by Mercury. Some serial killers under this sign include Ed Gain, aka the grandfather of Gore. He was a murderer and body snatcher. In 1957, authorities discovered that he had exhumed corpses from local graveyards, fashioning keepsakes extracted from their bones and skin. Soon after his mother's death, Gain began to create a woman's suit so he could crawl into his mother's skin. Henry Lee Lucas Henry Lee Lucas, aka the Confession Killer, was convicted of murdering his mother in 1960 and two others in 1983. He gained notoriety as an alleged serial killer while incarcerated for these crimes, when he falsely confessed to approximately 600 other murders. Lonnie Franklin Lonnie Franklin, better known by his nickname, The Grim Sleeper, was responsible for at least 10 murders and one attempted murder in Los Angeles, California from 1984 to 2007. Lonnie earned his nickname when he appeared to have taken a 14-year break from his crimes from 1988 to 2002. The air sign Aquarius is ruled by Uranus. Some serial killers under this sign include Gary Ridgway, also known as the Green River Killer. He was convicted of 49 murders committed between the early 1980s and the late 1990s. 
Before his identity was known, the media gave him his nickname after the first victims were found in the forested areas near the Green River. Robert Hansen Robert Hansen, popularly known as the Butcher Baker, was a serial killer active in Alaska between 1972 and 1983. Robert abducted, raped, and murdered at least 17 women, many of whom he hunted in the wilderness with a rifle and a knife. Jerry Brudos Jerry Brudos, aka the Shoe Fetish Slayer, committed the kidnap, rape, and murder of four young women between 1968 and 1969 in Oregon. He engaged in necrophilia with the bodies of his victims and preserved specific body parts, satisfying his sexual fetish for women's feet, lingerie, and shoes. The fire sign of Aries is ruled by Mars. Some serial killers under this sign include Richard Kuklinski, also known as the Iceman. He engaged in criminal activities including, but not limited to, operating a burglary ring and distributing pirated pornography. Between 1980 and 1984, he carried out a minimum of five murders, with prosecutors characterizing his actions as driven by a motive for financial gain. Herbert Mullen Herbert Mullen killed 13 people in California in the early 1970s. Mullen believed that the Vietnam War had produced enough American deaths to forestall earthquakes as a blood sacrifice to nature. But with the war winding down by late 1972, he would have to make that quota up himself. Donald Harvey Donald Harvey claimed to have murdered 87 people, though official estimates are between 37 and 57 victims. He was able to do this during his time as a hospital orderly. His murder spree took place between 1970 and 1987. The air sign of Libra is ruled by Venus. Some serial killers under this sign include Fred West, an Englishman who committed at least 12 murders between 1967 and 1987 in southwest England with his wife, Rose West. At least eight of these murders involved the West's sexual gratification that included rape, bondage, torture, and mutilation. The victims' dismembered bodies were buried in the cellar or garden of the West residence, which became known as the House of Horrors. Bobby Jolong Bobby Joe Long, aka the classified ads rapist, abducted, sexually assaulted, and murdered at least 10 women in the Tampa Bay area in Florida during an eight-month period in 1984. He would get his victims by calling service numbers from the classified ads. Angelo Bono Angelo Bono, the second half of the Hillside Stranglers, was convicted of killing 10 young men in Los Angeles, California between October 1977 and February 1978. He had developed an extensive criminal history before he teamed up with his cousin. The water sign of Scorpio is ruled by Mars and Pluto. Some serial killers under this sign include David Parker Ray, aka the Toy Box Killer. He was suspected to have murdered 60 to 100 victims. Though no bodies were found, David was accused by his accomplices of killing several women. He used soundproofing methods on a semi-trailer, which he called his Toy Box, and equipped it with items used for sexual torture. Leonard Lake during the mid-80s, Leonard Lake, along with his accomplice Charles, raped, tortured, and murdered an estimated 11 to 25 victims at a remote cabin near Wilseyville, California. Human remains, videotapes, and journals found at the cabin were used to convict his partner on 11 counts of murder. Nanny Dawes Nanny Dawes, aka the Giggling Granny, was responsible for the deaths of 11 people from mid-1920 to 1954. It was revealed that she had killed four husbands, two children, one of her sisters, her mother, two grandsons, and a mother-in-law. While this exploration is intriguing, it's essential to approach the topic with a healthy dose of skepticism. Many argue that the correlation between astrology signs and criminal behavior is purely coincidental or the result of confirmation bias. Let's not forget that there are millions of people born under each sign who lead entirely non-criminal lives. If we missed a serial killer or skipped over your sign, let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.